Good morning everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today's video is going to be a day in life vlog with all of us. Um, we've got a couple of exciting things on today. We are going to... Ready? Oh, excuse you, are you alright? Oh! We are going to a um, dog soft play centre. I've hired out a dog soft play. It's got bouncy castle, um, it's got ball pits, it's got everything. And we're meeting up with 11 Malamutes going there. We've also got um, the... In <laughs> My goodness. The England final um of the uefa world cup that we're in against italy which we're hoping to win so we've got all the family coming around to watch that um and shane's doing some gardening today and um oh and uh, last night i did a groom nico is now fully groomed um and it's a bit of a mess downstairs but we've got sent a new hoover so i'm going to do a bit of an unboxing i'll start off with that and then we'll get into the rest of the video we kind of got sent this new Hoover from Old Tenix, so I thought I would. Uh, I didn't bother Hoovering last night. I thought I'd save it and do it this morning, so I could show you what the Hoover's like and give you my first reviews. Um, if you are interested, I will leave a link in the description box below. But just wait until I've actually used it, so I can give you my full feedback on it. Um, it does a forty-minute runtime. It's got four different Hoover heads that you can use with it. And the bit that I really liked is it's got an infrared, infrared sensor on it so that you can, the Hoover will assess the level of dirt in the carpet and it will even max up the power itself if it senses that there's more dirt or it will leave it at the standard power. So it's got two different kind of speed, not speed, is it? Suction power settings. So I'm going to give it a go now. I'm just going to pick up some of the hair um, because that amount would destroy any Hoover. And then I'll give it a go and we'll see what we think of it. Okay, so I'm going to put it in the bag. I need a bath. Pick up some of this hair. Thank God you don't shed like this. Ooh. It's like a full dog. I should not be wearing black on a day like today, guys. Black was a very bad decision in terms of outfit, I'm not going to lie. So that's that bag. I'm just going to show you. I have picked up the majority, but there's no picking everything up. It's still all there. Little tufts of it. So next plan is to hoover it. Um, and in case you're wondering, I chose this rug specifically because it's so patterned and so similar to their colouring. It does kind of hide the hair when you zoom out. So there's always hair in the house, obviously, because we've got four pets, four hairy pets. But um, the rug does hide somewhat from photos and everything unless you go proper close up. Right, so we're gonna have a Hoover. Right, buddy. It's Hoover time. It's Hoover time. Let's give it a go. We're gonna slot this in here. Uh, let's move this out of the way. Get you ready, Phil? Boom, 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 boom. Here we go. What do you think, Phil? Let's have a look so it's got all the hair in the drum um but the key bit for me is the head oh let's see you can see a little bit of hair but not much it's cleared most of it out of the drum but also i would say i've used many many hoovers all the main brands i go through quite a lot of them um but i would say that this would be super easy you know when you do get the hair stuck in there you can see a little tiny bit now to clean out so I really rate that. I'll just show you the other heads that you can get with it as well. So four different heads. I'll be honest, in terms of hoovers, this is really the only head that I use. I think this is the, you can use this one for stairs. Um, it's got a different brush roll that you can put into this one, which I think that I would definitely use. Um, and then you've just got your standard hoover head um, attachment. But mainly this is the one I get the most use out of in terms of like everyday hoovering up around the lounge and everything. 
Um, but yeah, highly rate that. It does also come with a wall attachment for the charger so that you can have it stood upright for um, charging. But yeah, I think it's, I, I put mine in a cupboard and I don't have a plug in there. So I generally just take it out to charge. But um, I really, really rate that. I like how the hair didn't get too clogged up because you saw the amount that was still left on the floor. Um, and it looks like it's got quite a good drum space too. So yeah, highly rate that. The best bit though that I haven't actually told you, it's only £149 on Amazon. So in terms of like its competitors, it is so much, I mean, so much cheaper. I want to say about half the price. Um, so really, really affordable and really decent. Um, so like I said, guys, if you are interested, I'll leave a link in the description box below for the Alternic uh, Hoover. It was kind of gifted to us, but I'm very, very happy with it. Um, okay, right, what next, Phil? What do we need to do now? What have you got stuck in your phone now? Ah, I just hoovered. I just hoovered and I can see all this stuck in your fur. Get it out. I don't even know what that is. That little oh and i've dropped it on the carpet little green bits from the park yeah so look at you looking at the camera right next job we need to go to the shop we need to go to the shop do you want your fur back sorry right let's go to the shop so we have just come to the park i had to change my top after that hoover and clean up because it was black and it was just foolish wasn't it mia it was foolish we got Mia dressed and Nico. It's actually Sunday today. So the plan today is we have hired a indoor soft play centre for dogs. Um, so we've got, I think, 11 Malamutes meeting us to go to this soft play, which we're really excited for. Um, but obviously Nico isn't dog friendly um, and especially not on an indoor place with like bouncy castles and stuff. Lots of stuff that she can get territorial over. So she's not coming, um, but obviously, obviously she will still be walked. So we've come to the park with Mia, just us, just the girls. Yeah? Just the girls? Uh, yeah. I'll go to the park. Ah. Uh, the park? Ah. Uh, oh, you can say park. Why aren't you saying it? Because the camera's rolling, that's why. Um, so yeah, we come to the park and just pop Nico up a little podium to get a photo. Because you guys are very cute. And yeah, we're going for little walkies. So we just got a very cute photo of these two being adorable. Now we're going to keep on with our walk. Cute. They're such a good gang, Nicole. Especially when you're on your own, you're even better. Good girl. Off we go. Going up. Up. Good girl. One step. Two step. Three step. Climbing. Yeah. Do you need help? Yeah. Help? Yeah. No, no help. Well, you can't do that. Amelia, need help? Yeah. Mama, help. Help. <laughs> you stuck. Ah! Uh oh. Oh dear. Now you're stuck. You said you needed help. What are you gonna do? Can you do it. Amelia, push. Yeah, woo! No, finish with that one too. Okay, what next? What do you want to go on next? Here you go. Hello. Hello, good girl. Good girl for waiting. Amelia's coming. Go on then, up. Push! Hello. What, Mama? Mama, come. Thank you. Say hello, Nico. Bye bye, Park. Hello, Nico. Hello, Angel. Say hello. You want to go back in there? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you running? I do like to let her just, you know, go off with a safe distance and explore on her own, build her own independence. No idea if that's right or not for parenting, but that's my style. Nico's gonna get you. Well, 
Where are you running to? You're on the hunt, aren't you, Nico? You're hunting for squirrels. Mia's just running away. Rah! Bird! Loud bird. Paddle, back. back. You want to go back in your pushchair? Oh. Yeah? We've had enough running around chasing birds. Oh, who's my smart little cookie? You got the car keys. Don't unlock it because I think we're in range. You put them back. <laughs> Let me have the car keys. No, you're not going to give them to me. Do you want to go in your chair then and we'll go to the car? Because I think you've unlocked it. Oh, you're going to put them back for me. Good girl. Put them back. Thank you. Right, go sit in your chair. Yeah, good girl. Ready? There you go. So just put that back in there. And now we're going to go home and see the other dogs. You want Nico? You just spent all that time with Nico. See the other doggies. Quick, go find him. Say hello, Dada. Hello. Gonna help. Gonna help. Pass me that. Pass me the hammer. Get me the hammer. Hammer. On the floor, by the bill. Get me the hammer. Good girl. Thank you. Good girl. Helping Dada. Thank you. Have to do this. Look. Yeah, go on then. It's heavy. Go on. Hit it. So it's knock it down for me. Good job. I like it. Oh yeah, it's looking good. Look guys, this is what he's doing. And I was trying to explain it earlier. So this is this side's done. Let me zoom in. You see where it's got all the plastic coating? So it looks all smart. Whereas this is what he's trying to cover up. And I changed all the guts. Yeah, I've already said about the guts. The guts are all new. So yeah, that's what he's doing at the moment. Man of many trades. All the recent videos have been doing everything. Isn't he? He's a handyman. With his little helper. Amelia, can I come in your house with you? Can I come in? Knock, knock. The dogs want to come in too. Hello. Can mummy come in? Mama, Mama come in. Okay, just mama. Not really room for anybody else, is there? Okay, you shut the door. Say bye, Teddy. Bye. Bye, shut the door. Shut the door. <laughs> Whoa. You gonna sit in your chair? So this is Amelia's little playhouse. Oh. <laughs> Hello. The doggies want to come into your house. Hello, Phil. <coughs> The big bad wolves, they're gonna huff and they'll puff and they'll blow <laughs> your house down. Yeah, the big bad wolves go, oh, <laughs> huff and puff, huff and puff, oh, <laughs> Nico go, oh, Philip, <laughs> you are such a goofball. <laughs> What's he doing? You drawing? You guys, you just... Okay, so she opened the door and the dog's all barged in. Now I'm stuck. <laughs> Are you Please do not shut me in here, Amelia, with these three dogs. Oh my goodness. Amelia! Amelia, oh no. <gasps> Amelia, are you serious? You guys. I can't even stand up in there. Amelia, open the door. I can't reach the door. I'm stuck, she's on my foot. I can't reach the door. Ding dong, excuse me. Excuse me. Ah! Push, let me in, open. Thank you, out we go. 
out. Come on, dogs. You guys, this is silly. They're not leaving. Right, Mummy's turn. Mummy's going out. Excuse me. Ugh. Oh, my God. Oh, my back. You got, oh, now you get out. Right, it looks like Phil's staying in there with you, Amelia. Yeah, he huffed and he bluffed, puffed and he blew his way in. Well. Okay then. Right, it's no Amelia's house no more. Bear with us a second, guys. There we go. That's much better. Got the boys in there. Hello. Hello. We're now in the front garden. And Mia likes to get me stones and cut them. Can you give me some more? Some more. So. He's hogging it, isn't he? Philip, come on. More stones. Did you get it? Good boy, Teddy. Give it to me then. Did you get more stones? Put them down. Teddy, give her. Teddy! Oh! Hello. <coughs> Mum asleep. Now, go sleep. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Mama's awake. Mama's awake. Hello. <laughs> sleep, okay. <laughs> Hello. What do you want? Do you want a hug? <laughs> hug! Ma. More what? Ma. Sleep, okay. Night night. See night night. Yeah. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Amelia! Mummy doesn't like that wake up call. No, don't pull my hair out. Ow, that will hurt. That will hurt, Mama. Oh my god. No. No. Pardon? Pardon? Ma. What do you want? Ma. More what? Ma. More what? Ma. Ah. Ah. Go on then, open it. Do you want some cheese? Okay. Yeah? Didn't know Milo liked cheese. That's new. Go on then. Go on, Milo. Oh, I think he's finished. Oh, no, he wants a little bit more. Milo likes... So that's Milo's bit, okay? That bit's for Milo. How nice. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> Does that feel funny? Okay, put it down for Milo. Milo can eat that bit. And then you eat your bits. Okay? No, uh, uh, no not that bit. Uh-uh, that's Milo's. These bits with Mia's. Good girl. Much better. So I just stuck Mia down for her nap and um, we are just about to set off to go to the dog soft play with Phil and Teddy. So I think that's going to be a really long video. So that'll be a separate video, but I'll include some of the best bits in this as well. Um, so if you've made it this far in the video, you get to see the best bits of the soft play centre. Good boy! You got on the slide, good boy, Phil! Come on, Come on. What's this? Come on, good boy, Phil! Yay, Phil! Oh, no. Phil, Teddy! This was a bad idea. Phil, come on! Come on! You can do it!
soft play meanwhile Milo is going to sleep I was just finishing off editing the soft play video while she was sleeping um let's go get her up did you take your hair clip out <gasps> you ruined your hairstyle Amelia you looked cute yeah, put it back. Good girl. Do you have a nice nap? Job coming down the stairs. Did you do this? You did, didn't you? You tipped up the dog's water bowl. Mm hmm. Show everyone what you did. Are you proud? Proud? Very proud, okay. Go help me clean it up. That's a lot of water, Amelia. So I'm lucky your dad hasn't seen this. Teddy's helping. <coughs> Why don't you go help Teddy? Kneeling. Who wants to help him? Who's going to help Dada? Jane finished the guttering. It's looking all pretty now. So they've got new gutters and then soffits and fascias. Now he's gardening. With Mia helping, and we're just getting ready to set up for the football. Put it in there. Thank you. Good job. Excellent gardening, Amelia. Thank you. Thank you. Are you raking? Good girl. Rake the garden. Good job. Put it in, Teddy. Go on. Yeah, you pushed it. Look, come on, Teddy. Go on. Put it in. Good boy. <laughs> Where are you going with it? I feel like Teddy wants to play too. Oh no, it's stuck. We're just lounging in our egg chair, waiting for all the family to arrive. I do need to start cooking soon, actually, for everybody. Um, but just watching Shane hard at work, basically. Dogs are up. I think, I don't know where Neeks is, but they'll always have you here. Give him back, back. Back. Okay, so this is our setup for the football tonight. <laughs> Got our projector screen. We're about to sort the projector. Um, we just cleaned up the garden a little bit. Uh, we'll have some dinner out here in the fire pit. The only thing is, uh, it's too light right now, so we need to wait for the sun to go down and it to get a bit darker. So I think first half will be inside, second half we'll watch out here once it's darker. Kitty, say hi. Ella, is it coming home? Yeah. It's coming home. It's coming. Teddy. Nix is here. And Phil's over there. So guys, we're now into 30 minutes of extra time. I think we're at like 24 minutes right now. Um, we've had to come inside because the projector died. Um, the football's going on that long. And I think it's going to go to penalties. And it will be a penalty shootout to determine the winner. I must see Michael. Come on, come on now. Yeah, they can't. If they score, do they win? Yeah. If they score, do they win? Yeah. This is sick. No, this is the last one. No, that's fair. Why are you going? Italy have won. What? Yeah. Italy have won. No, they haven't. 
Yeah, yeah. What? Has he missed that goal? Three now. He's missed. We've missed three. Did we not? Yeah. yeah.